Wow, I'm so out. I'm back in a hurry here. I want to keep going on this red planet here. Red before. One o'clock in the afternoon. That thing's huge. So what I get Doug's footage, and a lot of you guys, I get your footage, and sometimes it's like this. I just clean it up. What you're always seeing is the professional cleaned up version. So, welcome to my show. Let's start with this weirdness. If you didn't watch the other three, I think this is the fourth one. Please do so. Um, you can start anywhere of today's videos and see a lot of weird stuff. So, um, let's go in here and see if we can bring some light on this thing. See what we're actually looking at. Deck said it was pretty dark. Brought the light all the way up. Take some of the blackness off of it. I've definitely seen some colors in here, Doug. All I'm doing, guys, is trying to bring some clarity. The darkness up here, I'm going to assume, is a planet, right? We're talking about this whole system just coming in, messing stuff up. Here's the sun squeaking out. Um, maybe you got a hint of a piston. Like, maybe up there behind the other room, behind the sun. But, you know, a lot of times your guess is good as mine on these. Doug don't know, that's why he's sending them in saying, check that out. Check this out. I mean, he keeps sending me these great red planet shots. Look at this one, guys. Let's clean that one up. There's one of my videos. It's a little, just um, freestyle, I call it, videos. This is just trying to show you some current stuff in Ohio. And, um... Doug does this. He doesn't do it for a living. He does it for free, like me. <laughs> um, that's incredible looking. That's a gas giant, Doug. Gotta be. I'm taking my time on it, because it's a pretty cool looking capture. I'm going to bring the lights down. Add some sharpness. Auto-correct. Yes. Man, that's just weird. I think you're looking at the gas giant. I'm going to just assume with all my friends it's the gas giant behind the sun or the sun simulation of the sun. What you tell me? That looks like the gas giant. You can see it's pretty big. Pretty big, pretty big. Big enough to make me say what, what in the world is that? And I'm going to assume that's our sun, um, right in front of the gas giant, and uh, that's about the best I could do on something like that. What do you What do you want to do? It's pretty amazing looking. I gotta say, it's pretty amazing looking, Doug. So let's let's add some light to it. Nah, let's not add light. Let's take the light down. Gotta face it. Seeing this every day, Doug's just saying, Chris, I gotta record him, I gotta record him. Look, what is Gas Giant? Gas Giant, right? Herculus, Gas Giant. Sun Simulator. Planets on the right. There's another one. Look at the different shot right there, Doug. And then it starts getting his nice shots. night shots. These are middle of the day shots. I mean, look like night. Look at, I like this one, Doug. Nice one. Let's decorate it. Let's see what we get, guys. I'm going to light down a little bit. Defog it. Dehaze it. Auto correction might make it brighter. It did. I'm going to turn it down. I'm going to sharpen it, and then I'm going to go ahead and dehaze it a little bit more. The hazing always brings it in a little darker too. 
Look at turning down the glare. Look at that. That's like, man, what's going on with that, Doug? Okay, so we see like a double exposure. So it's hard to read that one. Let's go to the one. If we could find one like that without the double. See the double exposure? That's not going to give you a true reading on whatever's going on there. So whatever that is, I don't care. This one, you got a dark planet. The double exposure is not good. You probably hit it real fast. I've done that before. You hit the button on your camera and your phone real fast, you'll get a double exposure. But you got to do it really fast. Just more, more, more junk in Doug's skies. This right here. This is 11:15. Doug was talking about this yellow one. Um, let's do. Let's sharpen this up a little bit and dehaze it. Now watch how the dehaze takes away the fog or the blur, and it just does a little focusing. So we got a combination of fog out there, screen alignment. Everything's playing part of it. Um, I'm gonna try to get it as straight as I can, so we can get a true reading on it. I don't think it's the moon, guys. I know, almost about to tell you, it's not the moon. This is really the picture. The rest of that stuff's all the garbage on the screen. But that's your actual picture, Doug. Now, this looks like four o'clock in the afternoon. Looking, I think, north. Very dark. Um, maybe it was raining, I don't know. But that, very trippy looking. Um, that's about the best you can get that, Doug. I don't want to change the color because the color was yellow. Let's see. Can't mess with it. See, it comes in so dark, Doug, that if I do anything, see how it blacks it out. But do contrast, I pick up your screen marks. So anyways, let's let it be a yellow whatever. Maybe a good yellow whatever. Move movement along November 17th. Trying to get caught up on Doug's best of the best of Doug's. You guys want to be part of the research on this stuff. See the blue up there? Dead giveaway. It's a blue planet. Here's another shot like that. Got your yellow, your yellow moon right there. Look, guys. Little D haze. Clear it up. The two. Focus. Gonna stop off. Just moving it along. Clearing that up. I think personally that's like debris, yellow moon, more reflections by the planets right there. I think it's a good shot, Doug. Um, kind of took it sideways, but there's nothing for me to fix that. So if this is what Doug was looking at, it's definitely interesting. So you think, you, you know, Alaska would get these shots and you think, well, that's like a lot of, you know, just clouds from a storm. But I've seen it enough to know that these are, uh, this is the bottom of probably Planet X or, I mean, Nibiru with the yellow moon right there or a two. So, or a combination of two or three layers. Anyways, um... Let's go to, this is like, I think, the fourth video. I'm going to go to the fifth video. I try to pop out seven of these, Doug. So you better be busy in the chat room. Talk to you guys later. And by the way, I do receive tips. PayPal in the description. Thank you. Smile. <laughs> Goodbye, guys. All right, one more video, okay?